Well, it's springtime and we love gardening and we love the flowers, but we don't love the dreaded ticks that come with that. Today we're at Trillium Creek Dermatology doing our own little version of TikTok with Emily Barker. Emily, what environments do you find ticks? Ticks like to hang out in wooded and grassy areas. They like to cling to the tall grasses and kind of wait for the host to walk by so that they brush up against them. But I've also removed ticks here in the office of patients that were just in their own backyards or in their gardens. So not just out when you're hiking. So what do you do if you find a tick on you then? So if you find a tick, time is of the essence. You want to make sure you remove it in a timely way. Um, fine tip tweezers can be used to gently grasp the tick very close to the skin. You want to make sure you get as close to the head as you can and just pull upward in a smooth motion. You don't want to twist because you want to make sure you remove all of it. Oh, um, and then, yeah, and then you want to wash that area with soap and water. I tell patients too, an easy way to dispose of them is just to flush them because um, killing them when they're so small is sometimes hard. So just dispose of them, make sure they're gone. So what are some of the symptoms someone might have that's a tick-borne illness. Yeah, there are several tick-borne illnesses to consider in Ohio if you get bit by a tick. Um, we want you to be watching out for signs like fever, fatigue, muscle and joint aches, and then rashes, especially around that tick bite site. If you have any of those after being bit by a tick, it's best to call your healthcare provider. We do test for Lyme disease. Um, we treat suspected cases. We work closely with our specialists as well to do that here in the office. That's what I was gonna ask. Yeah. When should you see a dermatologist? Yeah, so it's best to come in at the first sign of any concern. If there's a tick bite and a suspected you know, tick-borne illness, it's best to get treated early. Um, so we also find ticks during our skin checks and we remove them in the office. So we kind of see the whole range of tick-related visits here. What about any spray or anything for your skin? Or are those good to kind of yeah. have when you go hiking? Yeah, <laughs> we do recommend like deep-based insect repellent, but also clothing plays a big role. So um, long sleeves, kind of making sure that the pants are tucked into the boot. And then just mm. doing a really good tick check after being out in those areas is a good idea. To book your appointment, go to tcohio.com and visit one of their many locations. New location opening in Strongsville this July.